everybody, it's Mama J. And Spectre. We are here with six boxes from Gym Pops. It's a lot of boxes. They are. These each one of these boxes was $70 shipped. But this is three different runs. Run one, run two, run three. So we're each gonna pick a box from a run and then we'll open them up. Okay. Alright, let's do boxes. Alright, so with these two we got number 26 and number 50. Alright, I'll take number 50. The next one we had 69 and 13. 69. Alright, and then the last two are 13 and 26. I'm going to take 13. You're going to take 13? Yep. Alright. Alright, so you have yours now this one came really mangled in the post office, um, but it looked like everything was okay inside of it. I'm going to set my three down here. Yeah, so that, that might make more sense. room. Alright, but we got to pull from the same run. So which one are we doing first? I have the diamond run. How do you know that? It has a diamond on it. Okay. <laughs> I think that's your messed up box. Yeah. Alright, so go ahead and do yours first. It's that tape, it doesn't stick. But these are good boxes because they do hold closed. Need help? I'm trying to figure out how the box opens. You gotta pull from both ends. Alright, so I got a oh, it's just stuck together. Oh, you got two? Yeah. Oh, do you want me to open mine then? Uh, sure. Or do you want to show both yours off? Okay. Oh, I got three. Okay. Well, I got Zombie Mystique. That's pretty cool. Now, it does have a price of $34 on the side. I'm not sure if that still holds true. And then I got the Happy Birthday Deadpool. And that one is $17 on the side. So, so you got what? Uh, Fifty-one dollars. Now again, remember, guys, these were sixty-dollar boxes, seventy shipped. Uh, so once we're all done, we'll see if we came out ahead or behind. All right. So this one, I have three. So let's see which three I have. All right, I have. For eighteen dollars, Katie from Shang Chi, Shang Chai, Shang Chai, which is a Target excu exclusive. 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 She's worth eighteen dollars at that time. Uh, that one's actually a hot potato. So let me take this one first. Oh, lucky! I got a Christmas Thanos. Oh boy. And he, at this time, was worth $12. Oh, he's gone up in price. So that's $30. And, oh, and I got Skater Freddy. And he, at that time, was worth $28. Isn't that the one where he spent $75? I for believe Freddy? so. I think some, a couple people were looking for him. We don't collect Freddy's, but... So we got him. So at the end, we will go through and do a massive total on all of these. All right, which one are we doing next? Uh, sparkly. I'm assuming that's the glue, yeah. There's a knife. I have two. I have one. Okay. One large one. Oh, okay. So you gotta go first. Yeah. Both of these are in a protector. Okay. So I got Santa Claus from Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer. Oh. He was at 41. Wow! You go Santa Claus! <laughs> and then I have Joel from The Last of Us, PlayStation exclusive, 
46 dollars wow so you got 87 on that one yeah okay. that's pretty good all right i have a big one oh and i have a soda i didn't even notice that all right so i have alice in wonderland with alice in the teacup I'm assuming that this fell off. That can't be right. Um, I'm assuming she doesn't have a price on her. <laughs> what was that? Tag. That's for the, the soda. There's no way that's for that. Okay. Okay, because it says $7. Okay. Um, so, and then I'm pretty sure with that saying 7 that means this is a common. And it's just a common. Um, so we'll have to do a check on her to see if I went by the price on the bottom. It says 26, but I'm pretty sure that's not correct. All right. So what do we got now? The last one? Yep, the basic. Can you keep your stuff on your side, maybe? My stuff is on both sides. My stuff is on both sides. Can we keep your stuff on your sides? Okay, so I'm guessing this one is next. All right, Why so... Why does yours seem so heavy? <laughs> Soda on the floor. Well, I did. I just knocked the soda on the floor. There's only so much room here, so I'm trying to. I got one pop. Oh. I have three again. Yeah, go first. Yeah, you go first. That's why yours was so heavy. Yeah. Alright, so I have three. I have the witch from Jack Skellington, and at that time she was ten dollars. Uh, oh, I never got this one, and I did want him. I got Mowgli, uh, and at the time this one was worth twenty-eight dollars, and I got Simba, and Simba was worth thirteen. So. Okay. So I'm gonna guess I got a top pull because I pulled the price off one hundred and ten dollars. Okay. And I got oh, oh I got a scar. You did. You got a scar. <laughs> so that's cool. It is pretty cool. All right. So and again, we don't know how much Alice was worth. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna get a grand total. And again, we paid sixty dollars a box. Um, 70 was shipping, so 70 times 6 was $420. So, let's see where we came up. Alright guys, so we checked some value. Um, I have 8 items, Spectre has 5. five. Okay, so I'm going to go over my items first. Uh, Mowgli was 25 so he came down a little. Um, Katie was 17, came, came down. down a little. Thanos was 11, came down some, which, you know, is expected. Uh, Simba was 13, stayed the same. The Witch was 10, stayed the same. Uh, Jack actually was 10, and he had him listed at 7, so he went up. Freddie was 22. He came down quite a bit, um, but that's expected. Anything new always takes a massive dive um, right after it drops because it sits for a little bit. And Alice was worth 50. So my total was 158. Okay. So Deadpool, which is a cool pop, was 13. Zombie Mystique was 28. And, and they both have taken dives. Yeah, they both have taken dives. Uh, Santa Claus was 41, so he stayed the same. Joel was 46, stayed the same. And Scar took a dive, but he's still at $100 for a total of 228 What I've noticed with Pops is that when they're new, such as the Deadpool, the Mystique, because those are not brand, brand new, but they're kind of new still. Um, Freddy 
every one of those is going to take a die. So um, when they're put into mystery boxes, unlike us who we sit on our mystery boxes for a while before we open them, um, if the mystery boxes are open right away, well, you're going to get that higher value. But once these pops have settled a little bit in the Funko community, in the Funko world, the prices drop a little. Okay, and then anything that's $100 or higher always fluctuates by a few, you know, here and there. So for this to go from 110 to 100, kind of expected, you know. But yeah, everything else that's been out for a long time pretty much maintained the same value. Now, we did use Hobby DX. I'm not sure if Jim Pops uses Hobby DX or the Funko app. Yeah. But our grand total without shipping that we spent was $360. Our yeah. grand total that we got back in Pops at this moment in time was $386. So $26 over so what So we were paid. $26 over what we paid. Now, if we added shipping, we're under. $14 under because it would be $420 with shipping. For 20 was shipping, so that means that we would have been $34 under. Oh, yeah. So, either $34 under or $26, $26. up. So, it's right in that midpoint with shipping. Keepers, I'm going to keep Mowgli because I passed on him before. We don't do Freddy, so he definitely is not a keeper, and I don't think any of these are keepers. I might keep the Deadpool. Um, you had the metallic one in the birthday cake. Yeah, this one will definitely be an out of box. Oh, case. okay. He's definitely going out of box. Um, I have a little baseball bat display case off camera that I've been and, and it's cool. a full of pops. Yeah, it's a cool pop. So I mean, definitely if you want it, keep it. You know. Um, and then this one I'll have to ask one of my buddies, but this is one of his favorite games. So yeah, maybe, you know, find out, let us know. But other than that, if you see something you like, reach out. We may still have it. No promises. Um, but most of these are not keep. Most of the time, they're not keepers. Um, I usually buy to support the community, not because I'm going to get anything I want. <laughs> so, all right. Other than that, um, be sure you guys hit the notification bell because we are going live a few times a month uh, at random. So be sure you have that hit so that way you know when we do go live. And if you don't. Be sure you follow both of us on Instagram because I will announce when I have large things on my channel. I'm sure she's going to announce when she has games like YouTube Feud and Are You Smarter Than Me <laughs> coming up. Yeah, we definitely will continue the YouTube Feud and Are You Smarter Than Spectre, but they will be random. That's why he's telling you, smash that notification bell because that's the only way you're going to know or follow us on Instagram when we go live. So, all right, guys. We'll see you in the next video. Bye.